everybody welcome back to my channel my name is mellow oh! <laughs> and happy new year's everybody oh my god I, I know everybody is like bro 2020 let's go ahead and get into 2021 let's hurry this shit up but hey let's go ahead and pause or slow down for a second you know let's go ahead and watch some space balls together first you feel me and you know i just want to say you know rest in peace to all the people that we lost this year you know it's definitely a tragic and sad year and i just i hope all of you have found a little bit of joy and happiness towards the end of the year you know it's okay you know we all here together we all watching classic comedies and stuff you know i've never seen space balls of course i uh, i do know about it i understand that it is a spoof of star wars and i think maybe some other type of sci-fi fantasy i forget the type of name for it i just i, I really just want to thank all of you so much this has been a fantastic end of the year for me because I've been procrastinating doing YouTube almost all of my life so far and now that I'm finally doing it and it's starting to come into fruition and seeing the comments that y'all put down like it really it really makes me happy like the video share comment down below that definitely helps the channel grow and the video grow those are so important and then subscribe you know we're almost to 10,000 subscribers it is freaking amazing definitely follow me on instagram and twitter the links would definitely be in the description if you want to send me any memes or you just want to have a normal chat with me if you want to send me any movie requests or you know any game requests oh also i i, I know i showed this on one of my posts or whatever but i wanted to show y'all because this was really nice uh my little brother he got me this for christmas a male verse t-shirt you know it it really means a lot because it definitely shows that he like supports me it really warmed up my heart and almost brought me to tears you know like this is the back of the shirt and let's get into this movie reaction And a galaxy very, 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 very far away. Li there lived a ruthless race of beings known as Space Balls. Chapter 11. We immediately go into Chapter 11? The evil leaders of Planet Spaceball, having foolishly squandered their precious atmosphere have devised a secret plan to take every breath of fresh of of take every <laughs> every breath of air away from their peace loving neighbor planet Judia <laughs> today is princess Vespa's wedding day oh okay unbeknownst to the princess, but knowest to us, danger lurks in the stars above. If you can read this, you don't need classes. <laughs> oh, that was an amazing intro. I love the song. Oh, I wish they would have did the little tilt down like how Star Wars always does. I would actually say this looks absolutely amazing right here. Why is it so long? Okay. Damn, we still going? One hour later, two hours later, three hours later. Can you move it along? I'm all out of time cards. That's the Death Star Star Destroyer Special Edition. 2.0 version 6 5000 damn we break for nobody of course you don't break y'all got a big ass ship probably take y'all an hour to break colonel sanders <laughs> colonel sanders let me let you know the moment planet druidia was in sight sir so planet druidia is in sight sir you're really a space boy <laughs> thanks sir <laughs> I don't know if I would want to be a species called Spaceball. <laughs> <laughs> Look 
Come on. You gonna show him walking the whole way? <laughs> I can't breathe in this thing. You got some, I thought you had some sinus problems. Once we kidnap the princess, we can force her father, King Roland, to give us the combination to the air shield, thereby destroying planet Druidia and saving planet Spaceball. Everybody got that? <laughs> what the? <laughs> Thank you, I really appreciate that exposition. I'm loving these fourth wall breaks in these comedies. You really gonna spit in my face, bitch? <laughs> Everyone starting on the left foot. Daddy, that's your right foot. It's too late, keep going. <laughs> oh, he over there looking fresh in that outfit. And she looking beautiful. I don't know if she look as beautiful as Leia, but uh, I mean, hey, it, it's up to the debate. But Daddy? Mm -hmm. I don't know. <laughs> Sorry, Vespa. He's the last prince left in the galaxy. <laughs> Man, he took all this time to practice. Man, that dude looked like an NPC off from The Witcher. Come back! <laughs> Get you some water. You might be dehydrated. Oh shit, breaking bad in this bitch. Oh my god. Well, oh. is a lone star and his sidekick. Oh. That's barf. <laughs> that is so disgusting how the pepperoni just keep like popping off of him. <laughs> you gonna eat him? <laughs> Ciao, boys. Will you turn that thing off? What? What is it? <laughs> I bet a whole bunch of women would love to have headphones like that. <laughs> Hey, Mel Brooks. <laughs> Shall I have Snotty beam you down, sir? Is it safe? Oh, yes, sir. Snotty beamed me twice last night. It was one. Oh. All right, I'll take a shot at it. <laughs> Star Trek. Man, if that was me, I'd be like, hell no, I want to be beamed. The fuck? <laughs> Saying it like that. Beam him down. Yes, sir. Immediately, sir. Sir. Gee, beasties, what's happened to his head? Why didn't somebody tell me my ass was so big? <laughs> <laughs> hey, that, that's a compliment nowadays, sir. Could be the interlock system. <laughs> There's nothing like a good ass itch. You gotta dig all up in that booty. Ha <laughs> ha! We'll beam you back, sir. No more beaming. This time I'm gonna walk. President Screw, salute. What the hell? <laughs> oh my goodness, man. He got him some lazy ass employees. Fire a warning shot across her nose. Hey, I don't have to hey, put up some with terrible this. shots. I'm rich. Sorry, sir. Doing my best. Who made that man a gunner? <laughs> I did, sir. He's my cousin. <laughs> What's his name? That is his name, sir. Asshole. Major asshole. And his cousin? He's an asshole, oh. too, sir. Gunner's made first class Philip Asshole. How many assholes we got on this ship, anyhow? Yo! <laughs> I'm an asshole. <laughs> Keep firing, assholes! <laughs> I'm like really impressed with the the effects in this movie, man. Okay, we save her. But how? The minute we move in there, they're gonna spot us on their radar. Uh uh. Uh huh. Uh uh. Uh huh. Uh uh. Not if we jam it. Uh huh. You're right. <laughs> oh my God! We got Winslow in this bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Sir. <laughs> hey, that's a great ass cameo right there. You don't need that private. We're right here. Now, what is it? <laughs> <laughs> now, what is it? 
Damn, that is amazing how he can just do that. It appears to be jammed. There's only one man who would dare give me the raspberry. Lone Star. Jane, they knocked him the hell out. Come on, we gotta hop up this ladder and get out of here. Good, quick, hurry, darling. All the dog. Mog. I'm a mog. Wait, what about my matched luggage? <laughs> hey, stop fucking up my can. Sorry. Oh, snap, she got her a little fat little metal one right there. You will address me in the proper manner as your royal highness. I am Princess Vespa. Daughter of Roland, King of the Druids. That's all we needed. A Druish princess. Oh. <laughs> she doesn't look Druish. I mean, I don't, I don't know how they look, so I'm sorry. <laughs> she over here acting like she in a damn Shakespeare play, though. Man, these look like damn action figures. Now we will show her who is in charge of this galaxy. Yeah, hold on, tell me. What? <laughs> Buckle up back there. We're going into hyperactive. I love Uranus. <laughs> Two. Wait! What happened? Where are they? I don't know, sir. They must have hyperjets on that thing. Prepare ship for light speed. No, no, no. Light speed is too slow. We're going to have to go right to ludicrous speed. <gasps> I don't know if the ship can take us. What's the matter, Colonel Sanders? Chicken? Oh. <laughs> Did he like kind of bacaw right there a little bit? <laughs> I think ridiculous speed probably would have been enough. What the hell was that? Spaceball one. They've gone to plaid. Let me help you, sir. Are you all right, sir? <laughs> Fine. How have you been? Fine, sir. Good. It's a good thing you were wearing that helmet. <laughs> yeah. Oh my goodness. I did not expect this comedy to be this ridiculous. It's not as ridiculous airplane, but hey. This song sounds familiar. I remember hearing this in like the Scorpion King or the Mummy, whichever one. It's all the same. <laughs> Pardon me, sir. I have an idea. Corporal, get me the video cassette of Spaceballs the movie. Wait, whoa, I didn't know he was going this level. What? Damn, now this is a major fourth wall break. Instant cassettes. They're out in stores before the movie is finished. Nah. Here it is, sir. Spaceball. It's like nobody can. Good work, Corporal. Nobody Good can work. do a fourth wall break better than Mel Brooks. Oh, hello. I know, right? And Deadpool. <laughs> no, no, no. Go past this. Past this part. <laughs> what the hell am I looking at? <laughs> when does this happen in the movie? Now. You're looking at now, sir. Everything that happens now is happening now. What happened to then? We passed that. When? This is freaking mind blowing, though. Go back to then. When? Now. Now? Now. I can't. Why? We missed it. When? Just now. When will then be now? All those so, movies. Sir! What? We've identified their location. Where? It's the moon of Vega. Good work. Set a course and prepare for our arrival. When? 1900 hours, By sir. By high noon tomorrow, they will be <laughs> our prisoners. Oh! I can see why y'all wanted me to watch this movie. I will say that so far, I'm loving this more than Blazing Saddles. Yeah. Or Kissed. <laughs> Abandon ship! Women and mugs first! Well, I'm not Damn! Not sure. I thought it the Cock Blocker 2000! And we aren't gonna get very far once that blazing sun gets overhead. Nice dissolve. 
Oh, they was talking about the transition? <laughs> Get Jawas. I don't. <laughs> Dude, looking like he in a, a African tour trip. Uh oh, I think we woke it up. Goodbye, folks. Let me know how it turns out. Come back here, Dot. Come on, we gotta keep going. I, I wonder how her and C three PO would get it on. What's gonna happen? <laughs> Just weird ass thoughts. Who dares enter the sacred and awesome presence? Of the everlasting know-it-all, yogurt. Oh, I'll say that frame rate right there is a little bit uh questionable. Hey, but I do enjoy that Wizard of Oz reference right there. That's nice. Merchandising. Come, I'll show you. Open up this door. <laughs> Come. Oh my God, the level of fourth wall breaking, man. Merchandising, where the real money from the movie is made. Face balls the T-shirt. Space balls the That's a nice shirt. Space balls the that look like Transformers. Space balls the breakfast cereal. Space balls the flavor. Looks like Raisin Bran. The kids love this one. Last but not least, Space balls the doll. Me. May the Schwartz be with you. <laughs> I have an urgent message from Lord Helmet. He's lost the princess. Where? Somewhere in the sands of Vega. Tell him to calm the desert, you hear me? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I think y'all combing away the footprints. What about you guys? We ain't found shit. Hey, I think I know him from some place. You can read it. No, I was just clearing my throat. <laughs> of course. You understand it? Yes. What's it say? I cannot tell you that now. It shall be revealed to you at the end of the movie. <laughs> Never underestimate the power of the Schwartz. Come on, concentrate. Here we go. <sighs> <laughs> How can he concentrate when you're making them sounds, man? I would have been laughing my ass off. Far too powerful. But sir, your ring. Don't you have the Schwartz too? No, he got the upside. I got the downside. See, there's two sides to every Schwartz. What are you talking about? You on the high ground. Ha <laughs> 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 You serious? At last, I have you in my clutches to have my way with you. Oh, oh. Hey, what you do to my friend? The same thing I'm going to do to you, big boy. Oh, oh, and you too. Oh, oh. What? <laughs> oh my goodness, a grown ass oh. man playing with dolls. I find you strangely attractive. Of course you do. Druish princesses are often attracted to money and power, and I have both. And you know it. Oh, uh, leave me alone. No, kiss me. No, no, yes, no, no, yes, no, yes. Oh, 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 oh. Lord Helmet, what? You need it on the bridge, sir. Knock on my door. Knock next time. Yes, sir. Did you see anything? No, sir. I didn't see you playing with your dolls again. Good. <laughs> Oh, snap. <laughs> I saw that in my comment section. Somebody was talking about Spaceballs toilet paper. President Screw. Ah, I told you never to call me on this wall. This is an unlisted wall. Sorry, sir, but it's very important. Why do you even have it in the bathroom? Tell them I'll be right there. Yes, sir. I already know she's about to look down. <laughs> I already knew it. I already knew it. That girl a freak. She, they, they lucky I ain't in this movie. Permit me to introduce the brilliant young plastic surgeon, Dr. Philip Schlotkin, the greatest nose job man in the entire universe and Beverly Hills. I can tell that nose is huge. If you do not give me the combination to the air shield, Dr. Schlotkin will give your daughter back her old nose. Oh my God. 
<laughs> so the combination is one, two, three, four, five. Oh That's man, the how brilliant! I've ever heard in my life. That's the kind of thing an idiot would have on his luggage. Thank you, Your Highness. What did you do? I turned off the wall. Yeah, what the fuck? And you turned off the whole movie. I must have pressed the wrong button. Yeah. Put it back up. Put yes, sir. Back yes, sir. <laughs> She gives great helmet. Shit. Hey, maybe. <laughs> Shit. The way that hair is, you feel me? You know what I mean. You see. What's the combination? <laughs> One, two, three, four, five. Yes. That's amazing. I've got the same combination on my luggage. <laughs> Prepare. <laughs> Nobody knows. It's coming from here. That can't be her. The trouble I see. <laughs> Nobody knows but Jesus. <laughs> Damn, you need to get you an album record, girl. What do you want? I'm Luke Skywalker. I'm here to rescue you. What do you want? It's me. It's us. <laughs> Stand up! Man, well, that was just a waste. Spectacular stunt, my friends. But all for naught. Turn around. Yeah, please. exactly. Ah, what a pity. What a pity. <laughs> Princess, you thought you could outwit the imperious force of. <laughs> this dude loved joking about Hitler. Stunt doubles! Hey, the tension right here in this the end of this movie is looking fantastic. I don't know if this is the end of the movie or not. You shot my hair! Son of a bitch! Oh, she better go Rambo! <laughs> Damn! How was that? <laughs> not bad. Not bad for a girl. Hey, that was pretty good for Rambo. Let's blow this joint. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> President Scrooge! Salute! Hail Scrooge! Ship is too big. If I walk, the movie will be over. Sir. Yes. Oh! <laughs> Never have that damn thing. He's, he's, he's definitely not wrong. The ship's too big. They'll never get through. How are they going to get the air out? I don't see any hoses or anything. Oh, I was about to say, I thought it was about to turn into a dick. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's not just a spaceship. It's a transformer. What the hell? I knew there was a transformer on that damn comic book. It's changing into... A gigantic... Maid. With a vacuum cleaner. The ideas that this man gets is just freaking inspirational, man. Just how creative this man is. Damn. Goodbye. Y'all getting more than just the Goodbye. air. So this is going to be some dirty ass air then. You gotta act fast. Step one, we reverse the vacuum and blow the air back onto the planet. Step two, we destroy that thing. I wonder if it's gonna blow everything like rightly back in place. It is! <laughs> Stupid, you got it much too high. It's down here where the shoulder meets the neck. I am your father's, brother's, nephew's, cousin's former roommate. So you know you're not related to me. <laughs> Absolutely nothing. 
which is what you are about to become. All right, smart ass. <laughs> Don't waste the time. Oh my goodness. You have the ring. Sword fight. And I see your Schwartz is as big as mine. <laughs> now let's see how well you handle it. Oh, pause. <laughs> I was gonna say that this is a, a good lightsaber battle, but I, I don't I don't know anymore. The ring! I can't believe you fell for the oldest trick in the book! <laughs> what a goof! What's with you, man? Come on! You know what? Here, let me get back to you. Oh! Oh, look at that! You fell for that, too! Oh! I can't believe it, man! Attention! This is Colonel Sanders in forward command. Abandon ship! Abandon ship! All personnel proceed to escape pod! What type of music is this to play when y'all trying to leave? What? Okay. Right when I just said that this movie wasn't as ridiculous, this this shit just went like completely ridiculous. Cancellation button! Hurry! Oh my goodness, I'm loving this right here. This is I like the move. Oh, that was nice. Where is it? Where is it? It's gonna be here. None of us knew where we were. And then Harry began feeling around on all the trees. And he said, What the hell? They really about to do this in this movie? Hey, what's wrong with this guy? I've never yeah, seen so Alien, but this is the only that? scene that I've seen because, you know, it's the internet. They've been spoiling it. Uh, 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 oh! Not again. I was about to say, isn't he the original dude? I had a feeling he's about to start dancing. The fact that they actually put a reference of Alien in this movie is, this is just on a whole nother level. Yogurt! Hello, boys. Well, you opened your fortune cookie, so here's your fortune. Lone Star, you know that medallion that you wear around your neck? It's a royal birth certificate, yes. And may the Schwartz be with you. <laughs> oh my goodness i love the references he'd be putting in this movie and the, just the fourth wall breaking there's nothing like it <laughs> oh my god really another one Man, this is a one-of-a-kind movie. It would be funny as hell if they had the original actor in this movie. <laughs> what are those things coming out of her nares? <laughs> hey, hey, watch my helmet. Spaceballs? Oh, shit. There goes the planet. <laughs> Gathered here together again. Why didn't you tell me he didn't take the money? I didn't think it was important. May I continue, please? Besides, he asked me not to. Can somebody get this man some coffee? <laughs> or some cocaine, please? Don't you see he loves me? <laughs> Excuse me, I'm trying to conduct a wedding here which has nothing to do with love. Please be quiet. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Don't be sorry. Be quiet. I'm, I'm sorry. sorry. <laughs> He's like, man, I'm about to slap the shit out of all three of them. <laughs> uh -huh. Princess Vespa, you take Prince Valiant to be your lovely wedded husband. Uh, well, I, th I suppose. Well, oh, I don't know. No, she doesn't. What? Ooh, I see you, boy, coming in there like Michael Jackson in that mug. Okay. Who the hell are you, Prince Lone? Your mama, bitch. <laughs> Yeah. 
Joan Rivers, wow. That's a surprise right there. I did not know she was in this movie. That was probably one of the greatest movies I've ever seen. It was like, it's like one of those movies that Hollywood is like making today, you know? That movie, Spaceballs, was pretty much a big movie of just fan service. The acting was pretty cool, you know? The special effects and the practical effects were freaking amazing. They were like Star Wars level. It really surprised me how good the stuff looked. The soundtrack, <laughs> I'm telling you, like, I love 80s movies. The soundtrack was amazing. See, the, the writing was fantastic as always. You know, Mel Brooks, he is a, a fantastic writer. I, I'm really loving his comedies. Just like how I said with Young Frankenstein, I enjoyed this movie for more, all of Mel Brooks films that I've seen so far, I enjoy them for more than just being a comedy. Like, Blazing Saddles, I love the acting in that movie and just the chemistry between, like, Gene Wilder and I, I'm sorry that I, I'm forgetting his name, Cleavon Little, I think. This movie here definitely felt like it was a whole bunch of fans that just got together and was like, let's just make a big spoof movie on all these like fantastic classical out of this world one of a kind sci-fi movies that, that's that's how this one felt but i just i really hope that y'all enjoyed this video as much as i did and i would love to hear your thoughts on this movie this movie is absolutely fantastic you know please share the video like the video comment down below that definitely helps the video grow and the channel grow I just, I, I thank all of y'all so much. Like, this is absolutely fantastic. Like, I, I'm I'm just full of lost for words when it comes to that type of stuff. Like, saying the rating that I'll probably give to this movie, I'll give this movie like a, a 9, a Man, I'm just so happy that I get to experience these movies that I've never seen with all of you and to hear y'all thoughts and see y'all interpretations of movies and what it means to y'all too as well. It's just like, it's just fantastic. But, you know, please follow me on Instagram and Twitter. You know, the links will be in the description. You know, y'all can contact me, you know, just talking, you know, about anything, you know, how your day is or, you know, sending me movie requests or video game requests or just any other reactions you want me to do. I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace. <laughs>